Hi, I'm Frankie and this is my dream. Heal the world, write the book and sell the story. Problem is, the world's falling apart. I can't seem to finish any stories and nobody has any money. Houston, weather, baby blue skies and melting clouds. Mood, daffodils with a dash of daisies. Let's go see what we can find. There we is. I found Cleveland Turner, the flower man, whose love of flowers helped him survive 17 years on Skid Row. What do you love about <laughs> flowers? I love just the beauty of What else do you love uh, that we don't know about? Yeah, oh, that, that I love. Yeah. Yeah, I love to go around and pick up found oblets and make something out of it. Make it change the whole look of it. Where do you find your objects? As I said, a rich part of town and they be done moved and thrown away broken toys. I get it, I, I can't pass by it. I have to stop and pick it up <laughs> and just make it look like art. When you were a little, like when you were say five, mm -hmm. what did you think you'd be when you grew up? I really want, I tell the truth, I really want to be a mule rider. <laughs> Ride that mule. I knew to see them people, you know, get on them. Look like they did joy. All the joy they had was coming up off this mule. And I'm still got a whole lot of country in me now. And when, when during your Skid Row days, were you, what was go, what was the strongest thing going through your mind at that time? A whole lot of people said, "Why you did it?" I, I was. <laughs> Sometimes I would like to lie, but I, I can't lie. Uh, uh, they say, your mama died, your daddy died, and you hated it. I really didn't have that on my mind. I just fell in love with that wine they called Thunderbird. And it was something in that bird that made me just fall in love with it and love the high, the high that I got from it. I could dance more and talk more and everything else more. So uh, that was it. Yes, another Frank. Did and when you were drinking, did the world look different? It was uh, uh, down the earth, dirt, uh, dirt. But uh, uh, yeah, and getting back to the flowers, I used to see a wild flower. This is when I was on the skid road. See a weed out there blooming. I take care of it, it. And have you ever wanted to drink since? Or? No. Oh yeah, I was sober for down in. I was down. I still go to those. They ate me. But I had I had four months. I had I had four months sober. Going to those day a meeting and just like that I took the girl out. Oh Yeah, so I don't have to <laughs> say no more. <laughs> but that was it. But did you yeah. get the lady? No, I didn't. <laughs> I got too crook. <laughs> I got too uh. crook. So and I, 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 I learned a lot behind it, you know, how low a man can go and come back if he's willing, but he got to be willing and turn loose a whole lot of things, you know. If I can tell the world one thing, I will tell them I'm blessed. I'm blessed. And at that moment, I felt pretty blessed too. Jump down, turn around, pick a bell of cotton. cotton. Jump down, turn around, pick a bell of day. Oh, Lordy, pick a bell of cotton. Oh, Lordy, pick a bell of day. Oh, 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 day. They say that the sun doesn't forget a village just because it's small. And perhaps the world shouldn't forget a man just because he feels small. I didn't go in search for anything else in Houston, not even myself. Oh, 
but I did find out that it's illegal to sell Limburger cheese on Sundays. there to anyone who's listening. Today I met the flower man. The flower man taught me the beauty of life beyond the bottle of Thunderbird wine and that you've never been through too much to wake up and smell the roses. He taught me more things than I think I've ever learned in my entire life and he's made me a lot closer to discovering what it is that I want to tell the world. Good night and good night flower man.